it's your boy Drunk Ink and Drunk Ink Gaming. I got another Fallout 4 settlements for you, and it is at shit. Where is it? Oh, King Sport Lighthouse. This place is not bad. Once I got it, I mean, it was a hard spot to get because I had Children of Adam, and they were just gamma raying me for the first time I ever saw one. And they got that gamma gun, and I was just getting razzed left and right. It was cray cray. It's really cray cray. Now, as you can see, at the front of the gate, as usual, a gate, two guards. Why? Because I like it like that. It's just my preference. I like two guys just like standing right there. And they got some clutch ass weapons. They have like uh, machine guns. So they really just, you know, maintain the front lines. So nobody gets in. Uh, we're going to go ahead and get in here. And the reason why I like this place, this house, pretty much like 85% of it is intact. I'm, I'm not going to ask. Maybe he's hungry and I'm not going to ask. <laughs> oh, man. All right. So once we get inside here, we have she's just going to go yes. over the seat and don't even sit in the seat. NPC logic, but yeah, we have a little TV, little couch right here, just chilling, and then and then he's gonna sit down in the seat. Maybe that's his boot. I don't even know. Over here, we got the the general store in this little area right here. Um, you know, we got the little little setup back here for him to do trading and whatnot. Put him in some clothes so I can tell he was a he was a trader. Uh, upstairs, uh, I still have like a bedroom setup kind of deal. You know, some beds so people can sleep in. But other than that, that's that's what I got for this this little house. It's not that it's not the too beat up. Not much, but it's something. My little scavenger. Uh, we got a little farm right here for the Brahmin. Uh, like I, I can close them here and they stay there. They're pretty much cool there. Uh, over here to the side, we have uh, the farm. Same setup. Yeah. Carrots, mud fruit, tater, tato. What do you want to call it? And corn. Yeah. This, I don't know if anybody wanted to ask me this or anything like that. At one point, a friend of mine did ask me about this. How do you get this and what is it? This is, uh, if you finish up with the Bunker Hill, like uh, Bunker Hill mission, which uh, the leader, the person that, that runs bunk, Bunker Bunker Hill will give you this mission. She would uh, tell you to help her out with something that's exclusive to her. And once you are done with it, you are you're going to be able to build this stand and this stand is where any bunker hill uh traders can come to your settlement and will go ahead and be available to you at your settlement with this right here i know some of them have this little fireplace but most this is guaranteed every time to have a a what's it call it a trader from bunker hill to be at your settlement so pretty much if i go to sleep right now I'll wake up he's going to be right here any of the three the medic the the armor trader cricket she they're gonna one of them will be there and sometimes i know it kind of glitches out and two of them will be here at the same time so like trash can carla could be here and cricket could be at the same time they'll be right here but this is guaranteed i like it that's why i put it here so if every time i'm out of settlement i'll just go ahead and trade with them over here we have the back end of the of the whole area and uh got a little guard up here because uh i got run over by gunners one time and this back end only had a gun and uh they were kind of running us up but ever since i put this guard post here we're good I, he just keeps them back and they they try to get cover all right now as usual i got an artillery spot always always gotta have an artillery spot and uh some more no i'm not i'm not a synth and then I have a turret overlooking the little edge right here, which I love these spots that have natural rocky walls so they can't come in the, the settlement. I love places like this. It's really good. That's I just have guns overlooking the area so because they just walk by and get laid out by the machine guns. It's really good to have like a nice natural rocky area. We're going to go ahead and go to the back end. I didn't do nothing with this lighthouse here. I wanted to do so, but it was just too small for me to do anything. And I said, eh, screw it. So I built the side about it. Right here is this nice little base that I built. 
right on overlooking like the whole area right here and i thought it was pretty good and i'm gonna show you the power supply of the place before we go into the area as you can see i got the little water purifier right there because this place is good for that and it's all being powered by right here massive amount of generators uh i like the fact that this little area was here and i made it into an area to do uh just for a generator room put this little thing right here and then bam everything got powered by it so everything that's the whole power supply for the whole base and uh see look at that made it to where it looked like it was being supported it's nice so we're going to go ahead and go in here and I'm going to go ahead and show you what I did in this place, which I like it. Uh, right off the bat, you see the clinic, get some cams and whatnot and all sorts of things. What's up? If you need fixing up, let's get a look at you. No, I'm good. Gonna pass. Let me know if that changes. A little area back here for her to fucking go ahead and do things. I like these little little coolers. They look like places for medical supplies and whatnot. That's why I have in there. Uh, if we go around, there's going to be a little bit of a barracks so people can sleep right here. You know, nice little area for, for people to sleep. Close this door. And then we're going to go downstairs real quick. This is the, the workshop. Got also power armor here. I said uh, I had an extra power armor. This is one of the first places I built with more power armor stations. And I said, hey, I got an extra power armor suit. Let me just go ahead and put it right here. And when I get more, I'm probably going to put more here as well. And this little area in the middle, little tools and everything to signify the workshop. And we have armor workbench and a weapons workbench. Like everything that you would need for a workshop is here. And uh, even some settlers work on that power armor. It actually look, it looks pretty cool. And it's all connected. Three stories. And, and it, it feels good to walk around here and, and have this area. And then up here, it's just I, I couldn't find a use for this place. I wanted to be like a little office and whatnot. But I said I needed more beds. I put it as like an office slash barracks, I guess. And uh, right now, that's that's all this place is. I'm probably going to do something with it later and uh, make it a little bit more spruced up and have a little more use out of it. And there was my fast travel mat. So I spawned right here. And that's pretty much it. That's the whole base, the whole grounds. And there you go. That's King Sport lighthouse that's how you pronounce it i think but yeah so leave a like if you like the place comment if you got some ideas for me to go ahead and build onto this place i'll go ahead and find a way to build it if you uh have any other ideas that i can do i would just try i would go ahead and read it up and uh, see what you got but other than that like and subscribe and i will see you guys a little bit later during the week with another project i'm doing another city and uh, I will go ahead and see you then. Peace. Crops been growing pretty good lately. Shut up. <laughs>